शचर दुलाला नाचत श्री हरे कीर्तन में सुंदर बाला शचर दुलाला नाचत श्री हरि कीर्तन में भाले चंदन तिलक मनोहर अलक शोभे कपोलन में भाले चंदन तिलक मनोहर अलक शोभे कपोलन में चुड़ादर शिवाले वन फुल मालाइया पर डोले शिर चुड़ादर शिवाले वन फुल मालाइया पर डोले पहिरण पीत पीतांबर शोभे नूपुर रुणो झुनो चरण में पितांबर शोभे नूपुर रुणो झुनो चरण में राधा कृष्ण एक तनो है निधुवन माजे बंशी बजाए राधा कृष्ण एक तनु है निधुवन बाजे बंशी बजाए विश्व रूप की प्रभु जी साही आओ त प्रकट ही नदिया में विश्व रूप की प्रभु जी साही आउत प्रकट ही नदिया में कोई गायत है राधा कृष्ण नाम कोई गायत है हरि गुण गा राधा कृष्ण नाम 
कोई गायत है हरि गुण गाना मंगल तान मृदंगर सान बाजत है कोई रंगन में मंगल तान मृदंगर सान बाजत है कोई रंगन में सुंदर बाला शचिर दुलाला नाचत श्री हरि कीर्तन में दुलाला नाचत श्री हरि कीर्तन में भाले चंदन तिलक मनोहर हल का शोभे कपोलन में शचे दुलाला नाचत श्री हरि कीर्तन में सुंदर बाला शचे दुलाला नाचत श्री हरि कीर्तन में हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे कृष्ण कृष्ण हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे कृष्ण हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्ण 
हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे जय जय श्री चैतन्य जय नित्यानंद जय जय श्री चैतन्य जय नित्यानंद जय द्वैत चंद्र जय गौर भक्त वृंद चंद्र जय गौर भक्त वृंद जय जय श्री चैतन्य जय नित्यानंद द्वैत चंद्र जय गौर भक्त वृंद चंद्र जय गौर भक्त वृंद जय श्री चैतन्य जय नित्यानंद श्री चैतन्य जय नित्यानंद जय द्वैत चंद्र जय गौर भक्त वृंद चंद्र जय गौर भक्त वृंद हरि नाम संकीर्तन की श्रील प्रभु पाद की श्री चैतन्य चरितामृत की श्री कृष्णा कविराज गोस्वामी की अनंत कोटि वैष्णव वृंद की ओम अज्ञानतिरंद से ज्ञानांजन शलाक चक्षुवन्मील येन तस्म श्री गुरव नम श्री चैतन्य मनोभीष्ट स्थापित येन भूतले स्वयं रूप कदा मह्यम ददा स्वदाक वंदेह श्रीगुर श्रीयुत पदकमल श्रीगुरून वैष्णवांश श्रीरूपम सागरजात सह गण रघुनाथन्वितम तम सजीव साइत सवदूत पर्जन सहित कृष्ण चैतन्यदेव श्री राधा कृष्ण पादान सह गण ललिता श्री विशाखान्विता नम ओं विष्णुपाय कृष्ण पृष्ठा भूतले श्रीमते भक्ति वेदात स्वामी नामिने नमस्ते सारस्वते देव गौरवाणी प्रचारिणे निर्विशेष शून्यवादी पाश्चातिणे वाछाकलतरुभ्य कृपा सिंधुभ्य पतिता पावनेभ्यो वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम जय श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु निनंद श्रीअद्वैतगदाधर श्रीवासादिगौरभक्तवृंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे Hare Krishna, welcome all of you. We are going to the new chapter today, chapter 15 of the Madhya Lila. Lord accepts prasadam at the house of Sarumbata Charya. So, this topic of Lord accepting prasadam at the home of Sarumbata Charya is only last part of this chapter. Probably, probably around 20 percent we can say. In the rest, 80 percent you want to know what is there in this chapter. Let's proceed here. This is Mahaprabhu accepting prasadam sarvamurti. What is this place? See if you see this one. First fourteen verses are devoted to Adhita Charya worshiping Lord Chaitanya. Then fifteen to thirty-six different festivals celebrated. Janmashtami, Vijaya Dashami, and it coincidentally now we have Vijaya Dashami going on now, huh? and we are uh, reading it at this time. Rasa Yatra, Deepavali. See Uttana, Dwadashi, hmm? <clears throat> all these festivals. So this is a prominent part of this chapter, uh, first part. And so and then the second part of the chapter, you find a big section, which is thirty-seven to one eighty-two verses. Lord Chaitanya bidding farewell to Bengal devotees. This is a very important section. How the Lord deals with different devotees, with Adwaita Acharya, Nityananda, Shivas. They are all his Panchatantra associates. Hmm? Hmm. And How Lord deals with Raghav Pandit, hmm. with Shivanand Sen, Kulina Gram, Vasis, uh, with uh, Shri Khandavasis, hmm. 
and then dealing with Sarumbhattacharya and Vidyavachaspati, Murari Gupta, Vasudev Dutta, all these things. And then comes the last part, which is Lord accepting Prasadam at the home of Sarumbhattacharya. That is 183 to 237, about 40-50 verses, last part. So, three parts mainly in this chapter. First part, uh, meeting Adhutacharya, Adhutacharya worshipping him and celebrating that it is a festival. So, one part is the festival part. Second part is dealing with devotees. Huh? Especially Bengali Vaishnavas came, participated in Ratha Yatra festival, we all heard it. Now, they are all going back to Bengal. So, how to bid farewell with the devotee? Hmm. Mahaprabhu is uh, teaching from his own example, very deep, beautiful section it is. That is major portion of this chapter. Hmm. And then the last part is uh, Lord going to the home of Sarumpatacharya hmm, and accepting Prasadam there. Hmm. So, let us proceed to the chapter here now. So, we, we are going to read the summary first, okay? Yeah. The following summary, chapter 15, the Lord accepts Prasadam at the house of Sarvabhama Bhattacharya. The following summary of this chapter is given by Srila Bhakti Vinod Thakur in his Amrita Pravaha Bhashya. After the Rathyatra festival, Sri Advaita Acharya Prabhu worshipped Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu with flowers and tulsi. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu in return worshipped Advaita Acharya with the flowers and tulsi <laughs> that remain on the offered plate and said a mantra, Yo si so si namo sute. Whatever you are, you are, but I offer my respects unto you. Then Advaita Acharya Prabhu invited Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu for prasadam. When Lord Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and his devotees performed the Nandosav ceremony, the Lord dressed himself as a cowherd boy. Thus, the ceremony was very jubilant. Then the Lord and his devotees observed Vijaya Dashmi, the day of victory when Lord Ramachandra conquered Lanka. The devotees all became soldiers of Lord Ramachandra and Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu in the ecstasy of Hanuman manifested various transcendentally blissful activities. Thereafter, the Lord and his devotees observed various other ceremonies. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu then asked all the devotees to return to Bengal. Lord Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu sent Nityanand Prabhu to Bengal for preaching and also sent Ramdas, Gadadhar Das and several other devotees with him. Then Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu with great humility sent some Jagannath Prasadam and a cloth from Lord Jagannath to his mother through Srivas Thakur. When the Lord bade farewell to Raghava Pandit Vasudev Datta, the residents of Kulina Gram and other devotees, he praised them for their transcendental qualities. Ramananda Vasu and Satya Raj Khan asked some questions and Lord Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu instructed them that all householder devotees must engage themselves in the service of Vaishnavas exclusively devoted to chanting the holy name of the Lord. He also instructed the Vaishnavas from Khanda <coughs> as well as Sarvabhama Bhattacharya and Vidya Vachaspati and he praised Murari Gupta for his firm faith in the lotus feet of Lord Ramachandra. Considering the humble prayer of Vasudev Datta, he established that Lord Sri Krishna is qualified to deliver all the conditioned souls. Thereafter, when Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was accepting prasadam at the house of Sarabhama Bhattacharya, Sarabhama's son-in-law, Amogha, created trouble in the family with his criticisms. The, mo the following morning, he was attacked by the disease of Vishuchika cholera. Lord Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu very kindly saved him from death and enlivened him in chanting the holy name of Lord Krishna. Sarvabhama Grihe Bunjan Svanindakam Amogakam Now, this is not a Bengali verse. This is a Sanskrit verse. Sarvabhama Grihe Bunjan Svanindakamamoghakam Angi Kurvan Sputam Chakre Gauraswam Bhaktavashyatam Because there's a very important incident in this chapter. It's quoting that, yeah, yes. While Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was taking prasadam at the house of Sarvabhama Bhattacharya, Amoga criticized him. Still, the Lord accepted Amoga thereby showing how much he was obliged to his devotees. Amoga had only one great qualification. He was connected to Sarambhattacharya. 
So Mahaprabhu accepted him. Therefore, he is quoting that Kaviraj Goswami. Jaya Jaya Shri Chaitanya Jaya Nityananda Jaya Dvaita Chandra Jaya Gaura Bhakta Vrinda All glories to Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, all glories to Lord Nityanand Prabhu, all glories to Advaita Chandra and all glories to all the devotees of Lord Chaitanya. Jaya Sri Jaya Sri Chaitanya Charitamrita Shrota Gana Chaitanya Charitamrita Yara Pranadhana All glories to the listeners of Sri Chaitanya Charitamrita Yara All of you. <laughs> Everybody is included in that. All Who the have Shrotagana. accepted it as their life and soul. So, Kaviraj Goswami praises the hearers and he also praises the associates of Lord Chaitanya also. Hey, Mata Mahaprabhu Bhakta Gana Sange Nila Chale Rahi Kare Nritya Gita Range While Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu stayed at Jagannath Puri, he constantly enjoyed chanting and dancing with his devotees. Like he did when Jagannath had come to the Gundiza temple also, isn't it? Mainly you will find Lord Chaitanya's activities, you know, rising in the morning, going and taking darshan of the Lord in the temple, hmm? and then performing Sankirtan for hours, then going with devotees to take prasadam, isn't it? Or prior to prasadam, sometimes they take a bath in the Narendra Sarovar or Indra Sarovar with devotees, correct, no? And then he takes prasad with devotees, and there is a little time for relaxation. Huh? And then again in the evening, one more kirtan, dancing. Up to the point of devotees getting tired, Sarudamadar has to inform Mahaprabhu that now devotees are finished now, they are collapsed. They are hungry, they are tired, they are thirsty. Then Mahaprabhu had no limit at all. <laughs> Isn't it? So, one interesting observation you will make in the time of Lachaita Mahaprabhu 500 years ago. Even the Bengali Vaishnavas uh, uh, would uh, leave Bengal and come to Puri for how long? Four months during Chaturmas period, correct? No? That time they would come and stay. Yeah. That means, you know, is there anybody nowadays who can leave their job and go for four months stay to any holy place? Is it possible? You know, in fact, to take off one day, two days also is very challenging now. Hmm. So, when people have their own field, they cultivate. Um, they have some employed uh, farmers, they cultivate. So they live like uh, Jamindars actually. Hmm? You will see in villages, you know, basically all you need in this world is you need rice, wheat, vegetables, fruits, cereals, and all these things come from the land. Hmm? And you need a cow for giving you milk, hmm? and you need a bull for plowing the field. Hmm? So you know, they naturally have every house had a cow and a bull, hmm? and they. Uh, uh, had all these crops and then everybody had some profession like for example Madari Gupta is a doctor for example and there are others Adhita Acharya Prabhu calls all the Vaishnavas and they study Bhagavatam regularly so the profession was actually very uh, cool profession they could actually take out time for uh, their spiritual life in a very wholehearted manner you can see their lifestyle correct no and also in, at that time and many Brahmanas used to uh, have Chatush party. Chatush party means like under a tree you sit and then you have 20 30 students, you teach them, you study and teach. Hmm? And then they would give you some Dakshina, Dakshina yeah. And life would go on. Huh? Nowadays, this uh, two things have become too too much uh, uh, highlighted in this Kali Yuga making money and uh, attraction for the opposite sex. Hmm? These, these things are vitiated nowadays. Mad as if this is everything now. Huh? Therefore, people slog hard to bring money and then then going to movie party and enjoying life. You can see that. So, you can see spiritual life, how uh, uh, these people practiced 500 years ago. Hmm? So, Mahaprabhu, this is what he is doing in Jagannath Puri. Huh? Some hours of the day, chanting, dancing with devotees and other hours of the day. And sometimes Mahaprabhu, after dancing, he would stop and make what he would do? Make others dance. Correct, no? he told Vakrashar Pandit to dance and he would sing himself and when Mahaprabhu would sing, other nine devotees will join him together to increase the volume, huh? to sing very loud. Sometimes we also heard Swaruddha Mother would uh, recite some verses from Srimad Bhagavatam or uh, Bilomangal Thakur's uh, Krishna Karanamrita and Chandidas's poems, 
exactly suiting to Mahaprabhu's mood. When there was Hera Panchami, he recited verses fitting to that, correct, no? And then Mahaprabhu would relish it and would go into great ecstasy. So either he is uh, dancing, singing to the holy name, or he is hearing some verses from Swarudra Mother and adapting the mood, or sometimes he would uh, ask questions to devotees, uh, uh, speak to devotees on philosophy, sitting together with devotees. Especially Srimad Bhagavata. Hmm. Also, he's telling Swarudha Mother, Bala Bala, he's saying, na? Bar Bar Bolo, tell me again and again. So, he relishes hearing. And then going to Jagannath Puri temple, taking darshan, taking part in the festivals, hmm. like the Ratayatra festival. Hmm. So, in this way, 24 by 7, Chattva Mahaprabhu was Krishna conscious with his devotees. Pratamavasare Jagannatha Darshana Nritya Gita Kare Danda Paranamastavana In the beginning of the day, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu saw the deity of Lord Jagannath in the temple. He offered him obeisances and prayers and danced and sang before him. Upala bhoga lagile kare bahira vijaya Hari dasi mili aise apanani laya After visiting the temple, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu would remain outside during the Upala Bhoga offering. He would then go to meet Haridas Thakur and return to his residence. Which is the place? Chaitanya Bhagalya. Read it. At noon, when there was an Upala Bhoga offering in a place called Bhoga Vardhana Khanda, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu would go outside the temple. Before going outside, he used to stand near the Garuda Stamba column and offer his obeisances and prayers. Afterwards, the Lord would visit Siddha Bakul, where Haridas Thakur lived. After visiting with Haridas Thakur, the Lord would return to his own place at the abode of Kashi Mishra. That is uh, Gambira, where he was living. Mm-hmm. So, this was Mahaprabhu's routine. One of the first activities of the day would be, he would go to the temple, mm-hmm. take darshan. Mm-hmm. Why it is written at noon? Before that, Mahaprabhu chants also. Uh, that is a place where he would chant continuously. You might have seen picture of Mahaprabhu chanting near the ocean also, you will see. Yeah, this one. See. Huh? Correct, no? Chanting Mahaprabhu, chanting. Absorbed. So he would actually chant till noon, continuously he would chant. Uh, there are places. And then he goes for darshan uh, to Jagannath temple and he would stand at the place of Garudastama because that was told by Sarumbhatacharya to him. Uh, and then he would offer prayers and then he would carry prasad to give it to. Yeah, Haridas Thakur. Or he would send Govinda to take Prasad for Haridas Thakur. And also he would uh, go to meet him and discuss hmm, Krishna consciousness with him. Gare vasi kare prabhu nama sankirtana Gare vasi kare prabhu nama sankirtana Advaita asiya kare prabhu rapu jana Sitting in his room, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu would chant on his beads. And Advaita Prabhu would come there to worship the Lord. See, even in his own room, he is chanting. Therefore, he is uh, y- yoga avatar for uh, yeah, spreading the yoga dharma of Harina. He is always chanting. In that uh, uh, song also, we sing no, about uh, Lord Chaitanya. He is always absorbed in Kirtan. Hmm? Either he is doing Kirtan himself or he is inducing all the devotees to sing. He is dancing himself or inducing everyone else to dance. Or hearing the verses of uh, Bhagavatam and other literatures on Krishna, directly on Krishna. And then he also would recite verses many times. Mm-hmm. So, Gandish Salile Dena Padya Achamana Sarvange Lepaya Prabhura Sugandhi Chandana 
While worshipping Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Advaita Acharya would offer him scented water to wash his mouth and feet. Then Advaita Acharya would smear very fragrant sandalwood pulp all over his body. Gale mala dena matha yatulasi manjari Joda hate stuti kare pade namaskari Shri Advaita Prabhu would also place a flower garland around the Lord's neck and tulsi flowers manjaris on his head. Then with folded hands Advaita Acharya would offer obeisances and prayers unto the Lord. Puja patre pushpa tulasi shesha ye achila Se sabalaya prabhu acharya pujila After being worshipped by Advaita Acharya, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu would take the dish containing flowers and tulsi and with whatever paraphernalia remain, remained, worship Advaita Acharya. <laughs> Yosi Sosi Namostute Yayi Mantra Pade Mukha Vajakari Prabhu Hasaya Acharya Re Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu would worship Advaita Acharya by chanting the mantra Whatever you are, you are, but I offer my respects unto you. In addition, the Lord would make some sounds within his mouth that would make Advaita Acharya laugh. In this way, He Mata Anyonya Karena Namaskara Prabhu Nini Mantrana Kare Acharya Bara Bara In this way, Advaita Acharya and Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu would offer their respectful obeisances unto each other. Then Advaita Acharya would extend an invitation to Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu again and again. So, what is the relationship between Advaita Acharya Prabhu and Chaitanya Mahaprabhu? Advaita Acharya saw Chaitanya Mahaprabhu as Supreme Lord, worshipable, adorable, and himself as his servant. And several times he made attempt to claim himself to be servant. There is one in the Adilila 7th chapter, you will find there is a verse Chaitanya Radhas Muyi, Chaitanya Radhas, like that. Chaitanya Radhas Muyi, Dasya Ranu Das, like that. So, he says that uh, I, I proclaim myself a servant of Lord Chaitanya and I feel great joy in uh, you know claiming this identity of mine like that. Not only I am servant of Chaitanya, I am servant of the Chaitanya servants, like that he says. Huh? On the other hand, Chaitanya had a different relation with him. He never treated himself as a master of Advaita Acharya Prabhu. He is Advaita Acharya Prabhu like, he, like whom? Ah, like spiritual master. Because Ishwara Puri was a disciple of Madhavendra Puri. Advaita Acharya also is a disciple of Madhavendra Puri. So, Mahaprabhu treated him almost just like his own spiritual master, which who didn't like? Advaita Acharya didn't like it. He said, you are Supreme Lord, why do you treat me as a senior, you know, like you treat your guru? So, therefore, Advaita Acharya here has come to worship him, you know, with a tulasi garland, he's putting tulasi on the head and beautiful garland and offering him obeisances with folded palms and Mahaprabhu is smiling and offering worship back to him. He, what Mahaprabhu wants to indirectly indicate in this is, see, you are you are calling me the Supreme Lord and worshipping me. Hmm? Because Sadhguru only uh, called him no? to come down to this world. Hmm? So, he, he worshipped uh, Shaligram Shila with Tulsi and Gangajar. Hmm? So, here also he is worshipping him. Well, Mahaprabhu has accepted his invitation and come. But now Mahaprabhu is saying, you are my superior, so I worship you back. Huh? Now why he uses the word you are see, so I see? Because if Mahaprabhu says that, no, 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 you are my spiritual master's God brother, and so I have to honor you. you know, if Mahaprabhu becomes formal, that will not be liked by Adhacharya Prabhu. He will hate it. He will start crying. He will say that, you know, no, 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 you are my master, you, know, you are the lord of my life. And then not only that, Advaita will not only just say, he will go and collect a gang of devotees and they would all proclaim Lord Chaitanya as Supreme Lord. Once he did that, also, once another occasion. So, and Advaita will start profusely praising him. Hmm? So much so that once Mahaprabhu told him, Hey, Acharya, don't praise me so much. 
too much praises ninda huh, to criticize them like that you would say so mahaprabhu thought that again i don't want to start a new uh, argumentation with him i will say something he will say something we'll go back and forth so yo asi so asi he said whatever you are you are i know i am worshiping so you may claim that you are my servant but i know you are not my servant you are my master so you are my master because you are my spiritual masters god brother so i see you as a master so that is the meaning of this so acharya rani mantra na ashcharya kathana विस्तारी वर्णिया चेन दास वृंदावन इंडीड श्री अद्वैत आचार्य इन्विटेशन इज अनदर वंडरफुल स्टोरी इट हैज बीन वेरी विविडली डिस्क्राइब्ड बाय वृंदावन दास ठाकुर भागवत पुनरुक्ति नाकलो वर्णन आर भक्त गण करे प्रभु रे निमंत्रण This Advaita Acharya's invitation was has been described by Vrindavan Das Thakur. I shall not repeat the story, but I shall say that other devotees also extended invitations to Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Yeka yeka dina yeka yeka bhakta grihe yeka yeka dina yeka yeka bhakta grihe mahotsava. एक एक दिन एक एक भक्त गृह महोत्सव प्रभु संगे ताहा भोजन करे भक्त सभा इन डिफरेंट डिफरेंट होम्स ही वाज इनवाइटेड बट इन द सेम होम अलोंग विद महाप्रभु अदर डिवोटीज आल्सो वेंट टू टेक लंच एंड दे वुड होल्ड अ फेस्टिवल चारि मास रहिला सबे महाप्रभु संगे लगना तेरा नाना यात्रा देखे महारंगे ऑल द डिवोटीज रिमेन एट जगन्नाथपुरी फॉर फोर कंटिन्यूस मंथ्स एंड दे ऑब्जर्व ऑल लॉर्ड जगन्नाथ फेस्टिवल्स विथ ग्रेट प्लेजर कृष्ण जन्म यात्रा दिने नंद महोत्सव गोपवेश हैला प्रभु लया भक्त सब The devotees celebrated the festival of Janmashtami, Krishna's birthday, which is also called Nand Mahotsava, the festival of Nand Maharaj. At that time, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and his devotees dressed themselves as cowherd boys. Yeah, Nand Nand Mahotsava. Yeah. Dadi dukda bhara sabe nijas kandhe kari. महोत्सव स्थान आयला बलि हरि हरि हैविंग ड्रेस्ड अप लाइक कवर्ड बॉयज ऑल द डिवोटीज कैरीड पॉट्स ऑफ मिल्क एंड योगर्ट बैलेंस्ड ऑन रॉड्स ओवर देयर शोल्डर्स दस दे ऑल अराइव एट द फेस्टिवल ग्राउंड स्टैंडिंग द होली नेम ऑफ हरि कानाई कुटिया आचेर नंद वेश धरि जगन्नाथ महाती हाय चेन ब्रजेश्वरी कनाई खुटिया ड्रेस्ट हिमसेल्फ लाइक नंद महाराज एंड जगन्नाथ महा माहिती ड्रेस्ट हिमसेल्फ एज मदर यशोदा आपने प्रताप रुद्र आर मिश्र काशी सार्वभौम आर पड़िचा पात्र तुलसी एट दैट टाइम किंग प्रताप रुद्र ऑल्सो वॉज ऑल्सो पर्सनली प्रेजेंट विथ काशी मिश्रा सार्वभौम भट्टाचार्य एंड तुलसी पड़िचा पड़िचा पात्र यहाँ सवाल या प्रभु करे नृत्य रंग दधि दुग्ध हरिद्रा जले भरे सवार रंग As usual Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu danced jubilantly everyone was covered with milk yogurt and yellow turmeric water Advaita kahe satya kahi na kare kopa Advaita kahe satya kahi na kare kopa 
लगुड फराय ते पार तबे जानी गोप At this time, Srila Advaita Acharya said, "Please do not be angry. I speak the truth. I shall know that you are a coward boy only if you can wield this rod about." Ha ha ha! Now, after we take the rod in the hand, and he will wield it now. You will see now. Tabe laguda, tabe laguda la ya, Prabhu firai te lagila. Bara bara akash feli lufiya dharila. Accepting Advaita Acharya's challenge, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu took a big rod and began to wheel it around and around. Again and again, he threw the rod into the sky and caught it when it fell. <laughs> yeah, I show you. I opened it. I don't know where it is. So there is a picture of that. Ah, this is the one picture. You will see. You will see. Up is throwing up, no? Yeah. You don't come beyond this. Yeah. So this is this picture. Hmm. This is another. This is another Vijay Dasmi. All of them dressed up like monkeys. This is another one. Huh. This one is different. This is the one. See, here Advaita Acharya is telling. He is standing here. You see that? Yeah. Advaita Acharya is telling to Mahaprabhu. I can only believe you are a coward boy if you can, uh, you know, wield this. He is saying. So Mahaprabhu is showing, demonstrating to everybody. All the Vaishnavas are watching now. <laughs> Yeah, this is the among the devotees. Shreera upare prishte samukhe dui paashe. Shreera upare prishte samukhe dui paashe. Pada madhya firaya laguda deki loka haase. Pada madhya firaya laguda deki loka haase. Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu wheeled and threw the rod, sometimes over his head, sometimes behind his back. Sometimes in front of him, sometimes to his side, and sometimes between his legs. All the people laugh to see this. You know how they do this, na? Yeah. You have seen that. See, they do like this, rotate like this, <laughs> or they first they rotate like this, and then they from this hand also they take like that. Sometimes from behind also. You have seen that. Sometimes below the leg also like this, <laughs> take like this. So what do you call this? Those who fight with the stick, they play this. One hundred. One hundred. Huh? One hundred. Yeah. What do you call it? अलात चक्रे रप्राय लगुड फिराय देखि सर्व लोक चित्ते चमत्कार पाय When Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu whirled the rod in a circle like a fire brand, the heart of everyone who saw it was astonished. Because when you rotate the rod very fastly, it makes a circle. Looks like a circle. हे मत नित्यानंद फिराय लगुड हे मत नित्यानंद फिराय लगुड के बुझवे ताहा दुहार गोप भाव गुडा नित्यानंद प्रभु आल्सो प्लेड एट वर्ल्डिंग द रॉड हु कैन अंडरस्टैंड हाउ दे वर एक्सटैटिकली इमर्स्ड इन द डीप इमोशंस ऑफ द कावर्ड बॉयज हां दैट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट यू नो बिकॉज़ व्हाइल प्लेइंग दिस गेम्स व्हाट आर दे अब्जॉर्ब्ड इन One of the things that very easily comes is what? That easily comes is playing. Correct? Now you can take a stick and play, but to remember the mood of a coward boy is very difficult. Correct? No. So these are all eternal uh, associates. You know, here Krishna himself is Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. This one was Balaram. So who can better rotate the sticks than them? You know, correct? Now in playing such kinds of, uh, so they are entering into a playful mood here. Even when uh, Nityanand Prabhu was staying in Shringarvat in Vrindavan, where he was waiting for Lord Chaitanya to manifest his sankirtan and lila, huh? at that time he entered into the mood of a gopa. Hmm? So he would actually, uh, uh, you know, playfully uh, deal with the uh, brjabasi covered boys. Huh? 
Uh, because Nityanpu entered into the mood of a covered by Gopa. He is Balaram. You know? Later on, of course, he went to Navdweep. Huh? Prataparudrera Agnaya Padichatulasi Jaganatera Prasada Vastra Ekalayasi Following the orders of Maharaj Prataparudra, the temple superintendent named Tulsi brought one of Lord Jagannath's used cloths. Bahumulya Vastra Prabhu Mastaka Bandila Acharya di Prabhura Gane Re Paraila. This valuable cloth was wrapped around the head of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. The other devotees, headed by Advaita Acharya, also had cloths wrapped of, about their heads. This Jagannath offered a prasad cloths. Kana yi kutiya Jagannatha dui jana. Aveshe vilayala ghare chila yata dhana. In ecstasy, Kanai Khutiya, who was dressed as Nand Maharaj, and Jagannath Mahiti, who was dressed as Mother Yashoda, distributed all the riches they had stocked at home. <laughs> as a part of drama, you distribute in charity. <laughs> After drama is over, you find you have given away everything. <laughs> In devotional circle, there is no death of anything because Krishna himself is with them all the time, correct, no? So, they were, because Nanda Baba and Ashwath are giving out charity to all the people who are coming. Deki Maha Prabhu Bada Santosha Paila Mata Pita Gyane Duhe Namaskara Kaila So, because they were acting as Nanda and Ashwath, so Krishna was doing <laughs> Namaskar to them. <laughs> Shri yeah. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was greatly satisfied to uh-huh. see this. Accepting them as his father and mother, he offered them obeisances. Parama Aveshe Prabhu Aila Nijaghara. Hey Mata Lilakare Gauranga Sundara. In great ecstasy, Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu returned to his residence. In this way, Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, known as Gauranga Sundara, Performed various pastimes. Vijaya Dashami Lanka Vijaya Radine Vanara Sainya Kaila Prabhu Laya Bhakta Gane Vijaya Dashami. That was covered by Krishna Lila. For which festival? Janmashtami. Now this is Vijaya Dashami is coming now. Huh? Yeah. On the day celebrating the conquest of Lanka, a day known as Vijaya Dashmi, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu dressed up all his devotees as monkey soldiers. <laughs> you have to keep your mouth big. They put a, you can put a, this thing, no? Decoration like a monkey. Uh, yeah, they put like that. Mask. <laughs> he said, put mask. <laughs> monkey mask. <laughs> now in the corona season, corona time, everybody is wearing a mask. <laughs> Looks like a, Hanumana Veshe Prabhu Vriksha Shakha Alaya Lanka Gade Chadi Fele Gada Bandiya Bangiya Displaying the emotions of Hanuman, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu took up a large tree branch and mounting the walls of the Lanka fort began to dismantle it. Ah, see here. <laughs> you seeing this picture? Yeah. Yeah. So, what is this does? See, Mahaprabhu is carrying a big log of wood, isn't it? All are wearing mukut also, see? <laughs> and other, other people in the Vanara's mood, they are saying, See the Ravana and everybody, they are showing direction. Beautiful, no? all wearing uh, you know, ornaments. No? They entered into the mood. Hmm. He mount, mounted the wall of Lanka fort and began to dismantle it. Kahara Ravana Prabhu Kahe Krodha Veshe Jagan Mata Hare Papi Mari Savamshe <laughs> Where is Ravana? Like that, you know, very great angry wood Mahaprabhu asked, you have stolen away the mother of the universe. 
i will destroy you with all your dest- uh, your family lineage huh? with everybody and all your family I'll, i shall kill you huh? you think gosaira aavesha dekhi loke chamatkara gosaira aavesha dekhi loke chamatkara sarva loka jaye jaye bale bara bara everyone became very much astonished to see the emotional ecstasy of shri chaitanya mahaprabhu and everyone began to chant all glories all glories again and again he mata rasa yatra ar dipavali he mata rasa yatra ar dipavali utan dwadashi yatra dekila sakali utan dwadashi yatra dekila sakali now we are entering to diwali hmm? third festival see when i used to live in uh, bombay chopper temple 1994 when when we had one of the days it was a gaur purnima day i think morning so they would have long guru puja on such festival days nityantra dashi or gaur purnima day and all so it will start at uh, somewhat like 8 o'clock or something like that and it will go till 9 9:30 or so because it's fasting also no? that day go till 9:30 and 9:30 maharaj would come and his katha would go till 1:30 uh, sometimes two also it will go till two then now it's anyway fasting till dusk so people would forget the watch <laughs> katha would they know that long kirtan long katha would be there but sometime maharaj won't come at 9:30 sometimes he would come at 10 or 10:15 he would come so one of the gorpurma days when he was there <clears throat> the uh, guru puja was going on kirtan suddenly somebody was shouting you know pai that they were shouting loudly we thought yaar who is there outside there huh? everybody was shocked and who was shouting radha gopinath prabhu <laughs> you know and govind prabhu they both became jagai and madai <laughs> you know spontaneously <laughs> you know so and they both are creating a havoc you know jagai madai you know and they both are talking pulling each other shika catching hand and pulling and everybody went around and some uh, some new people they they would have never made out what it is <laughs> we all could make out oh. and then radhak prabhu said hey jagai he said then we understood going to call him madai and then now they need nitan to na eh nitan bro they would call from the audience any any brahmachari anybody who over is around they would catch and make him one role and he would go and ask what i am supposed to speak and then and then he will speak after that it was a very spontaneous drama you know? and then they would say nobody is coming at chaitanya mahaprabhu they were wondering and then they would ask nitan to where is your mahaprabhu <laughs> you know <laughs> you know <laughs> do you think jagamadi will ask the question <laughs> and then from behind the crowd shridama prabhu would come running <laughs> he said chaitanya prabhu chakra <laughs> and dwarakadesh prabhu also huh? so many of them were spontaneously join you know so when i uh, saw that i remembered this one correct na no? mahaprabhu and associates performing one most amazing thing was nobody felt ashamed <laughs> those who acted they would not feel uh, uneasiness but there are other brahmacharis who are very shy type they would hide behind the crowd they want to watch also and they are afraid that i should not be <laughs> pulled <up. laughs> and dada gopinath pu says see if you want to enjoy the drama you have to act also <laughs> you would pull <laughs> you know so in the same manner here till, till now two uh, festivals are over what is the first one uh, what they did in janmashtami ah uh, the mood of covered boy ah uh, who told him that unless you wheel the rod adhe acharya told him and second uh, festival uh, what they did how to get a log of wood and uh, climbed on the wall and uh, was chasing after ravana correct all dress dress monkey <laughs> now the third festival is starting ei mata rasa yatra ara dipavali ei mata rasa yatra ara dipavali putana dwadashi yatra dekila sakali Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and his devotees partici- participated in all the festivals including Ras Yatra, Deepavali and Uthana Dwadashi. Yeah. Yeah, the Deepavali festival takes place on the dark moon night in the month of Kartik, October, November. The Ras Yatra or Ras dancing of Krishna takes place on the full moon night of the same month. Uthana Dwadashi takes place the day after Ekadashi in the vexing fortnight of the moon in the same month. All the devotees of Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu participated in all these festivals. We are very fortunate that we are reading this section exactly at this time. Huh? 
our uh, this thing is over uh, rasa yatra that's called sharad purnima and today is diwali day it's so exactly on diwali day we are studying this section first section 1 to 36 is all festivals hmm how it's amazing uh, coincidence huh? isn't it yeah so ek din maha prabhu nityanand elaya दुई भाई युक्ति कैला निवृत्ते बसिया सो फ्रॉम दैट इज ऑन वर्ड द नेक्स्ट सेक्शन स्टार्ट्स अबाउट नाउ फ्रॉम हियर ऑन वर्ड्स डीलिंग ऑफ चैत्र महाप्रभु विद वेरियस डिवोटीज वेरी ब्यूटीफुल सेक्शन इट इज फर्स्ट सेक्शन वाज या सेलिब्रेटिंग फेस्टिवल ऑफ कोर्स अदर चैत्र प्रभु इज होम वी डिडंट गो बिकॉज़ इट्स ऑलरेडी एक्सप्लेंड इन चैत्र भागवत एलैबोरेटली सो ही डिडंट एलैबोरेट इट but uh, the first part we read about festivals mahaprabhu celebrating festival with devotees mm-hmm. and here uh, second part is about dealing with devotees uh, yeah one day the two brothers shri chaitanya mahaprabhu and nityanand prabhu consulted with each other while sitting together in a solitary place ke vayukti kaila duhe ke ha nahi jane ke vayukti kaila duhe ke ha nahi jane phale anumana pache kaila bhakta gane No one could understand what the brothers discussed between themselves but later all the devotees could guess what the subject matter was Tabe Mahaprabhu Sabha bhakte bolaila Tabe Mahaprabhu Sabha bhakte bolaila Gaud deshe yaha sabe vidaya karila Thereafter Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu called for all the devotees and asked them to return to Bengal In this way he bade farewell to them सवारे कहिला प्रभु प्रत्यब्द आसिया सवारे कहिला प्रभु प्रत्यब्द आसिया गुंडिचा देखिया आबे हमारे मिलिया बिडिंग फेयरवेल टू ऑल द डिवोटीज श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु रिक्वेस्टेड देम टू रिटर्न टू जगन्नाथपुरी एवरी ईयर टू सी हिम एंड देन सी द क्लीनसिंग ऑफ द गुंडिचा टेंपल आचार्य रे आज्ञा दिला करिया सम्मान आचंडाल आदि कृष्ण भक्ति दियो दान नाउ विद ईच ऑफ देम यू स्पीक डिफरेंट थिंग्स सो दैट यू आर वेरी अटेंटिवली नोट अकॉर्डिंग टू द इंडिविजुअल महाप्रभु गिव देम स्पेसिफिक इंस्ट्रक्शन और एक्सचेंजेस विद देम फर्स्ट इज मीटिंग अदर चैरपु इज टेलिंग हिम व्हाट यू शुड डू या विद ग्रेट रिस्पेक्ट श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु रिक्वेस्टेड अद्वैत आचार्य गिव कृष्ण कॉन्शियसनेस डिवोशन टू कृष्ण इवन टू द लोएस्ट ऑफ मेन चंडालस Achandale dena naam nitai daya mai We say, no? Actually, even for Chandala's Nityan Prabhu distributed Krishna Prem. You know? But why he is telling this to Advita Acharya Prabhu? Because one who has attained the mercy of Advita Acharya can very easily attain the mercy of Nityanand Prabhu. One who has attained the mercy of Nityanand Prabhu can very easily attain the mercy of Chaitu Mahaprabhu. Yeah. This is Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's order to all his devotees. Krishna bhakti devotion to Krishna is open to everyone even low class men like chandalas one should follow this order in the disciplic succession stemming from shri advaita and nityanand prabhu and distribute krishna consciousness without discrimination throughout the world as papa is telling us we should do he has already done it yeah there are different kinds of men beginning with the brahmana and going down to the lowest platform known as chandala whatever one's position Everyone in this age of kali needs to be enlightened in Krishna consciousness. That is the greatest need of the day. Everyone is acutely feeling the pangs of material existence. Even in the ranks and files of the American Senate, the pin pricks of material existence are felt. So much so that April 30, 1974 was actually set aside as prayer day. Thus everyone is feeling the re- resultant pin pricks of kali yuga brought about by human societies indulging in illicit sex meat eating gambling and intoxication now is the time for the members of the international society for krishna consciousness to distribute krishna bhakti all over the world and thus follow the quoting amar agnya guru hayya tarayi desh every one every town village should be enlightened by the instructions of mahaprabhu hmm. and krishna should be distributed to everyone indiscriminately hmm, without a reservation so the whole world can be peaceful and happy huh? and that chandala means a dog eater 
and they can be written by mahaprabhu's benedictions it is not monopoly of any particular caste or something everyone should get a chance to revive it and dan charity this verse means the distribution of krishna consciousness is a charitable person one who is doing it hmm? professional men recite shrimad bhagavatam and discuss krishna bhakti for an exchange of money whereas devotees propagate krishna consciousness freely hmm? they cannot distribute such exalted transcendental property to everyone and anyone hmm. only a pure devotee only pure devotees of no motive other than serving krishna can do that nityanande agnya dela yaha gaudha deshe अनर्गल प्रेम भक्ति करी ह प्रकाशे श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु ऑर्डर नित्यानंद प्रभु गो टू बंगाल एंड विदाउट रेस्ट्रिक्शन मैनिफेस्ट डिवोशनल सर्विस टू द लॉर्ड कृष्णा कॉन्शियसनेस श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु दस ऑर्डर नित्यानंद प्रभु टू डिलीवर ऑल द बंगालीज टू डिवोशनल सर्विस इन द भगवद गीता नाइन गति Whoever takes Krishna consciousness follows the regular principles can return back to Godhead. So Bhagavan Sri Chakra is saying that there are Prakrita Sahajiyas who think Nithyanand Prabhu is an ordinary human being. They have spread the news that Chaitanya Mahaprabhu ordered Nithyanand Prabhu to return to Bengal where he suggests to marry and beget children. This is certainly a great offense against Nithyanand Prabhu. Such an offense is called Pashandi, Pashanda Buddhi or an atheistic remark. Offenders consider Nithyanand Prabhu to be like one of them, an ordinary human being. they do not know of nitan prabhu's identity with the vishnu tattva thinking tan to be to be ordinary human being is the business of mental speculators known as kunapatma vadis ye sri plaksha metal body which is a bag of kuna kuna petri dhatuke so they think of tan the prabhu's body to be material and be meant for sense gratification if they think like this they are meant for darkest regions of hell they say to the hanker for women and money who are self interested and have mentality of merchants they discover this kind of things with their fertile brains mm. they simply engage in money making business to cheat innocent people actually tan prabhu being an expansion of chaitanya mahaprabhu is the most magnificent incarnation he is not ordinary man mm. yeah although professional so called preachers support this idea such statements are not found in any authorized revealed scriptures actually there is no support for these statements made by sahajyas actually mahaprabhu gives him two instructions one is to go to bengal and preach another one is to get married but why mahaprabhu told him to get married one should see it's elsewhere available mahaprabhu said that i am a sanyasi i cannot approach the degraded fellows like chandala sir those who are drunkards and those who are smokers those who are because i am uh, seen as a sanyasi if i am seen to be mixing with such people then my standard will be reduced and people will not will be willing to listen from such a sanyasi but you nitananda you can actually marry and you can reach out to even the most degraded people huh? and you can reach krishna consciousness to them so mahaprabhu tells him like that and he mahaprabhu says even if i find you in a liquor shop i will never suspect your character huh? because you have a liberated uh, personality so he says in one place like that so in this way the, the both the instructions are connected go to bengal and preach is one instruction and get married will also assist in that preaching correct no but some people think that oh mahaprabhu told him that you get married probably mahaprabhu told him to go and relax and no, no need to you know and no need to preach then this a people can concoct and speculate which is offensive is saying ramadasa gada adara adikata jane तुम्हार सहाय लागि दिलु तुम्हारे सने नित्यानंद प्रभु वाज गिवन असिस्टेंट्स लाइक रामदास गदाधर दास एंड सेवरल अदर्स श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु सेड आई गिव देम टू यू टू असिस्ट यू या यू नो दैट द पास्ट ऑफ गदाधर दास यू नो ही वेंट वन डे इन द नाइट एंड देन ही हां ही कॉल्ड वन मुस्लिम व्हाट इज नेम काजी हां Kasi, chant Hare Krishna. He said, Kasi is actually sleeping. He got up. What? What? What are you saying? Chant Hare Krishna. He said, I want chant Hare Krishna. Don't disturb me. He said. And what did he, uh, he say? He said, Hey, Kasi, now you already chanted. Now it's too late now, <laughs> isn't it? So he shook him up and made him chant Hare Krishna like this. So very bold preachers. Hmm? Yeah.
మధ్య మధ్య ఆమె తుమాన నికట అలక్షిత రహి తుమార నృత్య దెక్కి బా మహాప్రభు సైజ్ వెరీ ఇన్ బిట్వీన్ ఐ విల్ కమ్ నియర్ యూ బట్ ఐ విల్ బి ఇన్విజిబుల్ ఐ విల్ బి హైడింగ్ మై సెల్ఫ్ బట్ ఐ విల్ బి వాచింగ్ హౌ యూ డాన్స్ ఐ షుడ్ వాచ్ యూ డాన్స్ బికాస్ యూ యూర్ ప్రీచింగ్ యూ విల్ ఆల్సో నాచురల్ డూ కీర్తన్ వెన్ డూ కీర్తన్ నాచురల్ యూ విల్ డాన్స్ అండ్ ఐ విల్ ఆల్సో యూ ప్రెసెంట్ దర్ బట్ హౌ ఐ విల్ బి ప్రెసెంట్ ఇన్విజిబుల్ మై దట్ ఈస్ సైజ్ యా శ్రీవాస పండితే ప్రభు కరి ఆలింగన కంఠే ధరి కహే తారే మధుర వచన శ్రీ చైతన్య మహాప్రభు దెన్ ఎంబ్రేస్ శ్రీవాస్ పండిత్ అండ్ విత్ హిస్ ఆమ్ అబౌట్ హిస్ నెక్ బిగాన్ టు స్పీక్ టు హిమ్ ఇన్ స్వీట్ వర్డ్స్ తోమార ఘరే కీర్తనే ఆమె నిత్య రాచివ శ్రీ చైతన్య మహాప్రభు రిక్వెస్ట్ అండ్ శ్రీవాస్ ఠాకూర్ పర్ఫార్మ్ కాంగ్రిగేషనల్ చాంటింగ్ డైలీ అండ్ బీ అష్యూర్డ్ దట్ ఐ షెల్ ఆల్సో డాన్స్ ఇన్ యూర్ ప్రెసెన్స్ యూ విల్ బి ఏబుల్ టు సీ దిస్ డాన్సింగ్ బట్ నాట్ అదర్స్ అమేజింగ్ నా వాట్ ఆర్ స్పెషల్ బెనడిక్షన్ ఫర్ శ్రీవాస్ ఈవెన్ టుడే యూ గో టు శ్రీవాస్ అంగన్ ఇన్ కోల్ భంగ డంగ దర్ ఇస్ వన్ యూ నో దట్ ప్లేస్ దర్ ఇస్ అ ప్లేస్ ఇన్ శ్రీనాథి దట్ ఈస్ అ హోమ్ ఆఫ్ శ్రీవాస్ ఠాకూర్ దట్ సేమ్ స్పాట్ వేర్ దే వుడ్ డూ ద కీర్తన్ హోల్ నైట్ కీర్తన్ దట్ ఈస్ కాల్ రాసస్థలి దట్ ఈస్ అవైలబుల్ ఈవెన్ టుడే యూ కెన్ వీ హెవ్ బీన్ నెక్స్ట్ దట్ ఈస్ అద్వైత భవన్ కరెక్ట్ నా సో దట్ ప్లేస్ ఈస్ అ వైబ్రెంట్ ప్లేస్ సో వెన్ వన్ ఈస్ డూయింగ్ కీర్తన్ మహాప్రభు సైజ్ దట్ ఐ విల్ పర్సనలీ కమ్ అండ్ డాన్స్ దర్ ఓన్లీ హూ కెన్ సీ హెమ్ శ్రీవాస్ సీ హెమ్ ఏ వస్త్ర మాతా కే దిహ ఏ ఈ సబ ప్రసాద దండవత్ కరియమా రక్షమాయి అపరాధ టేక్ దిస్ ప్రసాదం ఆఫ్ లార్డ్ జగన్నాథ్ అండ్ దిస్ క్లాత్ అండ్ డెలివర్ దెమ్ టు మై మదర్ సచి దేవి ఆఫ్టర్ ఆఫరింగ్ హర్ ఒబేసెన్సెస్ ప్లీజ్ రిక్వెస్ట్ హర్ టు ఎక్స్క్యూజ్ మై ఆఫెన్సెస్ వై మా ఫర్ సేయింగ్ లైక్ దిస్ Uh, Prabhu told that, that my mother, I have hurriedly, I have left everything and taken sannyas. Uh, you know, if you are very unhappy, I will leave sannyas and come and stay at home. Like that, Mahaprabhu said, Ma, Sajima said, how can you do that? You know, sannyas, you can never leave the order and come back. The whole world will laugh at us. Uh, the dignity of the family will be spoiled. Uh, anyway, my child, you have at least stay in a place where I can get some news about you. Uh, at least stay in Jagannath Puri. And then he agreed. He said, Ma, Ma, oh, mother, you tell me. wherever you ask me to stay i will stay there whatever you tell me to do i will do like that he says so she was broken into tears so in this way he has relationship with mother is very sweet said mother sachi but the most important thing is he knows how the art of pleasing her exactly now also he is saying that in case she is upset with me that vishrup already left home and i have also taken sanyas and leaving behind a widow uh, vishnu priya and a widowed mother Sachi Devi, while Jagannath Mishra is not at home, there is only one servant there. His name is... Uh, what, uh, huh? uh, Ishan. Ishan Thakur. Huh? He is the only person taking care of the uh, uh, mother Sachi servant. Huh? Otherwise, there is nobody else to take care. So, Mahaprabhu is saying that in case she is uh, having some feelings of, uh, you know, loneliness and I have left her behind, uh, ask her to excuse my offenses. Uh-huh. సర్వీస్ ఆఫ్ మై మదర్ అండ్ ఎక్సెప్టెడ్ దన్యాస ఆర్డర్ యాక్చువల్లీ ఐ షుడ్ నాట్ హ్యావ్ డన్ దిస్ ఫర్ బై సో డూయింగ్ ఐ హ్యావ్ డిస్ట్రాయిడ్ మై రిలీజియస్ ప్రిన్సిపల్స్ తార ప్రేమ వశామి తార సేవా ధర్మ తాడి కరియాచి వాతులేర కర్మ ఐఎమ్ సబోర్డినేట్ టు ద లవ్ ఆఫ్ మై మదర్ అండ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ మై డ్యూటీ టు సర్వ్ హర్ ఇన్ రిటర్న్ ఇన్స్టెడ్ ఆఫ్ డూయింగ్ సో ఐ హ్యావ్ ఎక్సెప్టెడ్ ద రినౌన్స్ ఆర్డర్ సర్టన్లీ దిస్ ఈస్ ద యాక్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఎ మ్యాడ్ మ్యాన్ యాక్చువల్లీ మ్యాడ్ మ్యాన్ ఓన్లీ బికాస్
Uh, Mahaprabhu actually became transcendentally ecstatic, therefore he could take sannyas, correct? No? It's a transcendental madman. So, this is a uh, situation of uh, uh, the Supreme Lord. Uh, separation between Sachi and uh, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is like separation between Yashoda and Krishna. She is Yashoda Tattva, original mother, correct? No? So, in this way, uh, actually Mahaprabhu knows exactly what if you say that will churn the heart of the mother. So, whatever he says now, they will go and tell her. And when she would hear it, she would cry. Oh, he is feeling like that. No, 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 no. What he did was perfect. He is doing so much good. Like that, she will say. If, if he sends a message to her that, you know, I am a sannyasi, you know, I have no time or whatever. You know, or if you say that, you know, I, I am a great soul, I have taken sannyas. No. The Mahaprabhu's mood is one of great humility you know, in dealing with uh, his mother. Vatula bala kera mata nahila ya dosha. Vatula mata more nakaraya rosha. See? A mother is not offended by her mad son. And knowing this, my mother is not offended by me. Kikaya sanyase mora prema nijadhana. Ye kale sanyasa kailo channa haila mana. I had no business in accepting the renounced order and sacrificing my love for my mother, which is my real property. Actually, I was in a crazy state of mind when I accepted sanyas. <laughs> now you'll go and tell this to Mother Sachi, she'll be very happy. Nila chale, nila chale acho mui tahara agnyate. Madhya Madhya Asimuttara Charana Dekhite I am staying here at Jagannath Puri, Nilachal, to comply with her orders. But at intervals, I go see her lotus feet. So this is what precisely she requested and he is precisely fulfilling it. So he is trying to understand exactly how to uh, speak the words pleasing to his mother along with the Mahaprasad of Jagannath. Nityayayi Dekimuye Tahara Charane Surti Jnane Deho Taha Satya Nahi Mane Indeed, I go there daily to see her lotus feet. She is able to feel my presence, although she does not believe it to be true. Because when Sachimata would cook and offer, suddenly she would find it empty, the boga plate. Huh? Because Nimai Pandit would come and eat. Huh? And she would wonder, no, did I put the boga or not? Again she would put, second time it will disappear. Huh? She would wonder how it is disappearing. Huh? So later on, Chaitamapu says that I come and eat when you are cooking for me. Huh? So in this way she would get uh, visions of Nimai Pandit appearing at home on and off. Yekadena shaliyana vyanjana pancha sata Shaka mocha ganta brishta Patola nimba pata Lembu ada khanda dadhi dugda khanda sara Shalagrame samar pilena bahu upahara One day my mother Shachi offered food to Shalagram Vishnu. She offered rice cooked from Shali Paddis. Pack. He is giving complete list of what he ate. Correct, no? So this, uh, the personality who is carrying Prasad will go and tell him. And that will confirm to Sajimata that who has come. Sajimata came and ate. The complete list is giving. Shali Paddis, vegetable spinach, mm-hmm. curry made of banana flowers, mm-hmm. and fried patola. Anybody knows patola? What is it? What is it? Paduval? Oh, Paduval Sarji. Patwal is Paduval, okay. With nimba leaves, pieces of ginger with lemon and yogurt, milk, sugar, candy and many of the foods. Prasadalaya kole karena krandana Prasadalaya kole karena krandana Imaira priyamora yesa bhavyanjana Taking the food upon her lap, mother was crying to think that all that food was very dear to her nimaya. Nimai nahi kayeta ke kare bhojana Moradhyane ashtujale bharilana yana 
My mother was thinking, Nima is not here. Who will accept all this food? As she meditated upon me in this way, her eyes filled with tears. Shigrayai mui sava karinu bhakshana Shunya patra dekhi ashur kari amar jana While she was thus thinking and crying, I immediately went there with great haste and ate everything. Seeing the dish empty, she wiped her tears away. Ke anna vyanjana khaila shunya ke anna pata ke anna vyanjana khaila shunya ke anna pata Bala gopala kiba khaila sababhata She then began to wonder who had eaten all that food. Why is the plate empty? She wondered, doubting that Bal Gopal had eaten it all. Kiva mora katha hai mane Brahma haiya gela Kiva kona jantu asi sakala khaila She began to wonder whether there had actually been anything on the plate in the first place. Then again she thought that some animal might have come and eaten everything. Kiva ami anna patre brahme na vadila Eta chinti paka patra yaya dekila She thought, perhaps by mistake I did not put any food on the plate. So thinking, she went into the kitchen and saw the pots. Anna vyanjana purna deki sakala bhajane Dekiya samshay haila kichu chamat karamane When she saw that all the pots were still filled with rice and vegetables, there was some doubt in her mind and she was astonished. Ishane bolai apuna sthana le paila Punarapi gopalake anna samarpila Thus wondering, she called Ishan, the servant, and had the place cleansed again. She then offered another plate to Gopal. Now whenever she prepares some good cooked food and wants to feed it to me, she cries in great anxiety. Tara preme ani amaya karaya bojane. Antare mana yesukha bakhya nahi mane. Being obliged by her love, I am brought there to sit, to eat. Mother knows all these things internally and feels happiness, but externally she does not accept them. E vijaya dasamite haila e riti. तहां के पूछिया तार करा यह प्रतीति सच एन इंसिडेंट टुक प्लेस ऑन द लास्ट विजयदशमी डे यू कैन आस्क हर अबाउट दिस इंसिडेंट एंड दस मेक हर बिलीव दैट आई एक्चुअली गो देयर अमेजिंग इवन ऑल द आइटम्स ही सेड करेक्ट ना कंप्लीट लिस्ट ऑफ आइटम्स नाउ ही सी हाउ डियर इट इज टू द हार्ट ऑफ सचिमा दा हाउ हैप्पी शी विल बी शेयर दिस दैट माय सन इज कमिंग एंड ईटिंग एट होम Ete ka kahi te prabhu vihval haila Loka vidaya kari te prabhu dhairiya dharila While describing all this, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu became a little overwhelmed. But just to finish bidding farewell to the devotees, he remained patient. Yeah. Okay, now Raga Pandit will do next class. 68. Hmm? Verse number. Shri Prabhupada ki, Gaur Bhaktarindra ki, thank you very much.